Christmas ski resorts are preparing for a bigger and earlier holiday season this year, starting this week. Fox 31 problem solver Shaul Turner is live in Idaho Springs with more on the economic impact. Shaul. Well, we've been traveling all along the I-70 corridor today, and those resorts are packed a little bit early. Remember, this is still the mud season technically, but tonight we've got great snow out here, and that means economic gains for these resorts since AAA extended the travel season from five days now to seven. It's a great start to the holiday season. From Europe to Denver, New York, more than 14 million people visit Colorado's high country resorts and attractions each year. Shredding, having a good time on the snow. Yeah, when the snow is falling, it's the best. An RRC associate study found Colorado's ski industry generates $4.8 billion and provides more than 46,000 jobs. Colorado's abundant snowfall this month means greater numbers at the start of the holiday season. It's just so awesome to be out here. And Arapahoe Basin reports an 18 inch base. Loveland Ski area has received 43 inches of snow so far this season, with 13 trails and four lifts now up and running. So mountains, fresh air. Keystone will open its North Peak this week, adding another 100 acres of terrain. Plenty of new trails for folks to experience over the Thanksgiving break. And will open night skiing. I've been skiing for 45 years, taught for quite a few, and I learned how to ski at night, so it's special to me. The lights, the music, it's a different feel. All resorts along the I-70 corridor are lighting the way for holiday travelers. We will have snow tubing up on top of our mountain. We'll also have ice skating on our Durkham Square ice rink in our village. Providing an economic boost that will last well into 2025. I'm just thankful to be out here and live in a place that everyone appreciates. Skiing is a legacy activity, a lot like golf. You learn how to do it so you can give it to someone else later. You know, a lot of these resorts are offering Thanksgiving meal deals, all sorts of stuff up here. But you, you want to be careful before you come up here. CDOT says make sure you check your car, make sure your tires are winter ready, and you carry an emergency roadside kit as well. Go online, take a look at the Epic Pass while you can still do that and get a good deal. As well, Eisenhower Tunnel was shut down a little while today over on the west side. We got through it just in time, but just another reason to check that Pinpoint Weather app for everything you need to know. Shaul Turner reporting live tonight in Idaho Springs.